Hello everybody, you're very welcome back to another video and we have episode 2 today of the Bayer Leverkusen career mode. Now obviously if you haven't watched episode 1 already I would recommend to go back and watch it before watching this if you haven't already. But anyway, so I believe our next game is against, yes it's against Ausberg I think. We'll just do a quick simulation for the training. Let's see I think we have a couple of offers here. Second now. I think I'm just gonna ignore them for now. Let's see how the team is looking. Timber is suspended for the next game, which is unfortunate, but that is all my fault for doing that uh that ridiculous tackle. <laughs> uh let's see now. I wonder if there's a way you can actually um what you call properly um Sim that are just that let the train and just automatically do it. I know anyway we've an offer for Aldi. Ooh, twelve million to Bayern. I mean I'm surprised Bayern wants him. I mean I don't think he's gonna get game time there, bit of a surprising one. Um Oh who is this? Ah, oh, Robert's off to Real Betis. I'll tell you one thing, that was actually a release clause that was activated. I completely forgot about that actually. 47 million I mean look for someone who was in their 30s not bad but anyway let's get right into our first game but yeah getting back to that uh 40 uh 40 I think it was 43 million I think it was um in the bank not bad at all look I don't like release clauses but I think that's a very good deal all in all uh anyway let's get into our first game of course we are in the white away jersey for this game obviously the last game was a 1-1 one, one draw against frankfurt so hoping to do better in this one right we win it back and we lose us right then let's see what we can do all right then up towards the abbey oh no Right here come Ausberg. Alright, let's hope we can oh yeah, here we go. Managed to get it back. There we go again. Right, Diaby. Let's see what skills he can do. Right. Out towards Verts. Under a lot of pressure. Nice pass though. Palacios here, right? Let's see what we can do. Come on, Diaby again. Alright then, I'm going to try and cut inside, ooh, not a million miles off, I mean sometimes these long shots work, particularly on FIFA 23, but all in all, not bad, alright then, another cross, oh, completely overhit that, alright then, time to make a run into the box, I mean, no, I'm going to go here actually, oh, and they have it back again, ooh, Oh, that was so unlucky. How did I not score there? My God. All right, a few minutes have passed. Obviously, I am doing this in clips. Ooh, just about. So obviously, like I said, I'm just recording the clips. There's no point in showing the whole games because it just takes up too much time. Right then, time to make another attack, hopefully. All right, in towards the Abbey. Come on. I'm going to take the shot. There we have it, 1-0, Moussa Diaby with the goal, absolutely incredible, and we are now 1-0 up, hopefully we can hold on, let's try and get a look of this on the replay, let's see, ooh, yeah, ooh, right in. Alright, so obviously a few minutes have passed. Absolutely delighted we have gotten the goal, but we have managed to hold on. Let's see, can we make another attack now? Oh, come on! Oh, very, very close from Schick there, I think. And there we go, it is now half time. Disappointing we couldn't score there, but look, let's see. Hopefully we can get a second in the second half. Maybe even a third, although I would be happy with just a victory, you know, we definitely need a victory, these are the type of games we definitely need to be winning against the lower sides. Right then, Hudson-Odoi, ooh, nice, 
bit of skill there. All right, then we go. Ooh. And Ausberg have it back. Is he going to win that header? And at least I have it back now. All right, let's see, can we make another attack? All right. Oh. Ooh, ooh. Come on, Patrick Schick. Go on. Oh, how have we not scored a second? I mean, that is unlucky. Right then, we have a corner. Let's put it in. Alright then, let's see, can we take another shot? Come on! Oh, unlucky again. Very, very unlucky. Right, we'll keep trying though. Ooh, maybe a chance for another. Oh, may have it back again. Alright then, Ausberg again here. Right, we definitely need to keep them out. Ooh, there we go. Oh no! Alright, we have it back again with Tabuso. Palacios. Right, back up to Diaby. Diaby's had a very good game so far up towards Chick. Let's see, can we put it in again? Vert. Chick again. Come on, let this be the one. On oh, another save. Tapaboso here. Alright then. Oh, I'll lose it again. Right. Okay, at least we have it back. Oh, bad pass. Right. Come on, lads. It'd be great to get the owl. Second. Alright, Ausberg again. Alright, then we have a back. A little bit of a push, but I think we'd be okay. Alright, then Diaby showing off his brilliant skills again. It's in towards Patrick Schick. Come on! Yes! There we go. 2 0. Absolutely brilliant goal. I believe that is Florian Vert's first goal of the series. Which is absolutely brilliant. He really is going to be a huge player for us for this series. Absolutely brilliant player in real life. It'll be interesting to see where his career goes. You know how much longer he will stay at Leverkusen as well. Ausberg making an out substitution. Right then, hopefully we can go for the third. Although I don't really mind. I'm just glad we got the second. You know, that's the most important thing of all. Oh, here come Ausberg. We definitely need to stop them. Easy save, right? I was expecting them to take a much harder shot than that. Alright, then Frimpong. I tell you, Frimpong's a very good player, very fast. Oh, and then we silly. Absolutely stupid pass from me. Right. Ausberg looking to get up. There we go. We have it back again. Let, let's see, can we go for the third? I mean, I would have taken the 1 0, but look, it is Ausberg. You know, they are one of the, you know, the lower teams. You always do like to try and get at least two goals if possible. But uh, all in all, it has been a pretty tough game. We have managed to probably get the job done. Very little time remaining. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, well, that's a little bit annoying. Ausberg have gotten one back. But the most important thing is we did manage to get that second goal. And we did get the three points. And there we go. That is the final whistle. But it is a little bit annoying. We couldn't keep the clean sheet. But all in all, I am happy we got the victory. That is the most important thing ever. Definitely a better performance than the, um, than the opening day of the season against Frankfurt in the last episode. Alright, we've got an offer here. Let's just see what it is. Azoman to Sausage. Jeez, I forgot we had a Mosin. 32 million. Or Azmon, however the hell you pronounce that name. You know me by now, I'm not great at pronouncing names. Let's see, we've 80 million the transfer budget. I'll tell you what, we still have a really good transfer budget remaining. Um. I'm just looking through the team now to see is there any positions, maybe even bench positions we could do with threatening. I'm I'm starting to have my doubts about Palacios. Now look, he's 23 and he's 78 rated. He is going to grow. But I do believe we could potentially get maybe a 19 or 20 year old midfielder that's like that rating and they'll probably, probably have better potential. Um, I do love Palacios, but I suppose I do want to be realistic at the same point. Now we don't really have anyone in the transfer hub. What I think I'll do is I'll see can we get a better price. See, I kind of, 
we have kind of a team of very good potential players. So I kind of I don't want to make you know load of new signings now. Well, I've already I've only made what two, but I want to of course save some and of course be realistic because we do have a very young team. A lot of this kind of starting eleven are all kind of in my plans. Whereas with other saves, it's kind of not. Oh no, that's not gonna work right. That's a pity. Anyway, we still have a really, really good transfer budget as Sin Stan. I completely forgot we had him, actually. Um, Alright, then. Yeah, um, I, I, yeah, I think we should keep it realistic, you know. Right then, let's see. Our next game. Ooh, our next game's a tough one against Leipzig. This is going to be a real uphill battle. But, let's see what happens. Hopefully, we can uh, get an old underdog victory. I would actually be happy with a draw in this game. I wouldn't be too disappointed if we drew it. But let's see what happens. Hopefully we can get the win. You know, that is the ideal. But when you do think about it, I know Leipzig have been a lot more successful. But we do have uh, two relatively similar teams. Alright then. That's a free ref. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, yellow card and everything for Timo Werner. Alright then, Frimpong out to Palacios under pressure. We still have it. Alright then, out towards Florian Verts. Patrick Schick. There we go. 1 0. You love to see it. Absolutely incredible. Very good build up play as well. And we are 1 0 up here at the Bayern Arena. Absolutely brilliant. Patrick Schick has just been absolutely brilliant for us in the last few games. There we go. Pretty well worked goal as well. Especially in the build up as well. Some of our build up play was brilliant, right? Let's see. Can we hold on? That's the most important thing, right? Then Leipzig coming. Oh, Jesus. Right, okay. Let's see what we can do. Alright, then we have it back now. Back to the keeper. Alright, then to Pusso. Towards Hudson Adoy. Let's see what we can do here. Patrick Schick again. Alright, then Hudson Adoy. Anyway, Leipzig have it back. Alright then, here we go again. It has been a couple of minutes. Oh no, Leipzig are on the attack here. Oh, brilliant interception from Taposo. Alright then, here we go. Patrick Schick again on the attack. And it's 2-0. There we go. This is absolutely fantastic. Brilliant start to the game so far. Fans and players absolutely loving it as well. Oh, sorry, I did skip. We couldn't get a replay there. Do apologize. It would be nice to see that on the replay, actually. Anyway, let's see. Can we go and get another and hold on? To be honest with you, hold on is probably the priority. But let's see what happens. Patrick Schick again. And there we have it. It is 3-0. What a start to this game. Unbelievable. I never thought I'd be uttering these words, but you know what, I might have to up the difficulty level. Like I was saying in the last video, I am unprofessional, I'm kind of going between professional and uh, world class. Kind of sometimes when I play in world class, I really struggle, sometimes I'm brilliant when I'm unprofessional. But sometimes it is balanced as well at the same point. But anyway... It's all about trying to go out here and get as many goals as we can. It is Leipzig. These are the type of games we need to be winning. But I think I will probably put it up for the next game. Alright. Ooh. Sometimes I like to try a few long shots. Especially when we're winning by a few goals. And geez, we're still a little bit away from half time as well. So, there we go. Alright. Hudson Adoy again. Let's see what he can do. Be nice to get Hudson Adoy or Diaby a goal actually as well. Oh, just over. Anyway, a little bit of a hard shot to try. Leipzig here with a corner. Let's see, can we hopefully defend it? And win that header. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh, God. Yeah, my pass is brutal. Right. Oh, no. I mean, it's not the end of the world if we can see it is. We are cleaning it up, but it will be nice to keep a clean sheet as well. Oh, there we go. Alright. Oh, 
Okay then, Florian Verts. Alright, up towards Patrick Schick. Let's see what Schick can do. And he's only gone and made it 4 0. You love to see it. Patrick Schick. What a man. What a man. I'm pretty sure that's his hat trick as well. Oh, I would have liked to see the replay of that. But anyway, not too disappointing. Absolutely lovely indeed. Right, it's half time now. Let's see what we can do in the second half. We are now a few minutes into the second half. And Leipzig are coming again. But we managed to keep them out. Oh, I can't believe this. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to, uh, what's the word, up the difficulty level. This is just a little bit unrealistic. Maybe we'll give it one more game and see what happens. Alright, here we go. Come on, come on. And you love to see it. 5 0. Unbelievable. I decided not to show you guys any more clips from that game because, look, you know, there was no way uh, Leipzig were coming back. There wasn't really much that happened. We had a couple more chances. Leipzig had one other chance as well, although it wasn't great. Um, but yeah, all in all, the rest of the game, there wasn't really too much. So, I, you know, I want to try and fit in another game in this episode rather than show you guys the rest of that game. But it was a great win overall. 5-0 um, in the end, absolutely brilliant. Probably too easy of a difficulty level, but I still think we probably would have won, even if we were on World Class. It was that good. But we will probably go ahead now and change it for the next game. Let's look. Oh, yeah, the team's a little bit tired, but not too tired anyway. We probably will look to rotate, especially once the DFB Cup comes along or whatever it's called. Oh, that's a tough fixture list. Dortmund, Bru Dortmund, then Bruges in the Champions League and Bayern. I'm just going to sim uh, past deadline day because... We're not going to make any more signings, like I was saying, and I don't. We've great budget anyway, so don't think we need to sell anyone. I actually ignore that for now. Right, I'll go ahead here and change the difficulty level up to world class. There we go. All right then. Yeah, gonna be a big game. Gonna be a very, very big game. Um, I mean, I'd, I'd be really happy with the draw. Like I was saying about Leipzig, I'd be happy with the draw. But let's see what we can do. Hopefully, we can go and get a victory. It'd be absolutely brilliant if we can get a victory. Chances are we're probably gonna lose, especially with up in the difficulty level. But let's just see what happens. But I have underestimated it myself a few times in this episode. So we will have to see. But um, should be an interesting game. Anyway, let's get right into it now. There we go. I have to say I really like the new cutscenes, I must say, in the game. Let me know in the comment section, do you guys like the new um, cutscenes or not? Well, I know that one was already in the game, them coming off the bus, but um, especially the ones outside the stadium, I think they're pretty cool. Although I believe there could be some more um, additions that could be had. Alright then. Jeez, I swore that was Erling Haaland for a second, even though it's Brandt. <laughs> I was thinking, what the hell? Is that City? Is he turned, gone back or something? But no. Alright then, Let's see can we get it up the pitch, right then up towards Frimpong, Diaby now, Frimpong making a nice run, absolutely beautiful from Frimpong, and there we go, 1-0 already, with a brilliant goal, brilliant run as well from Jeremy Frimpong, 1-0 to Leverkusen but the big question is can we hold it let's see what we can do all right Dortmund have a corner here oh got very lucky there oh yeah anyway that was an easy save the second one but yeah we are getting lucky here Dortmund have been at us a little bit lately of course I can't record everything um, or the video will just be insanely long. Right then, let's try and get it up the field again. Right then, Schick. Oh no. Alright, probably could have gone around him, but anyway. Dortmund back with it again. Towards Haller. Alright then. Royce. Julian Brandt. Gee, I, I can't get I just genuinely it just reminds me of Haaland so much. Don't know what it is. <laughs> Alright, Dortmund coming in here again. We need to clear it. There we go. 
Dortmund really starting to uh, get a lot of possession together here. Oh no, oh no. Alright. Anyway, <laughs> that was nice and easy for us anyway. But that didn't, or that wasn't much more of a threat. Right then. Alright, Diaby here. Let's see what Diaby can do. He's been a brilliant player for us so far in the first few games. Alright then, Florian Vert. Oh, so close. That was so close going in. Oh, if only. Alright then, being a couple of minutes with Dortmund have been putting us under a lot of pressure lately. Right then, here come Dortmund again. Ooh, got lucky there. Oh yeah, good tackle to win it back. Oh jeez, <laughs> should have went around him. Anyway, goal kick, not too bad. Alright then, to Bosso, to Palacios, up to Diaby. Alright then, let's see, can we get a few guys to make the run? There we go, Patrick Schick. Oh, we managed to win it back. Hudson Adoy here. Nice bit of skill there. Ooh, unlucky. Alright then, half time now. So yeah, very happy with the first half. We've managed to hold on. Of course, Dortmund have been putting us under a lot of pressure, but we have had a few chances as well. But I am absolutely delighted to be 1 0 up. Let's see, can we continue in the second half? I mean, continue and hopefully hold on to our lead. Alright then, Diaby. Back to Schick again. Oh, loses it. Right. Okay, we have it back now. Alright then, Hudson Adoy. Alright then, into its Florian Wurtz. No, couldn't get to it there. Dortmund back up here again. Haller in possession. Back to Haller. Up to Togden Hazard. There we go. Palacios wins it back. Ooh, bit of a little bit dodgy that, but there we go. All right up towards Patrick Schick again. Florian Verts. Is he going to take the shot on? Oh, lucky. Looks like Dortmund made a change. Don't know who that was. Anyway. Time to keep trying. Anyway, we have looked fairly good so far, although a little bit sloppy in possession, but anyway. Definitely need to improve on that. Ooh, here come Dortmund again. There we go. Have it back now. Palacios again. Up to the Abbey. Nice bit of skill there. Here we go. Florian Verts. Or no, it's Schick. Let's see if we can get it on the counter attack. And there we go. Absolutely incredible. Bayer Leverkusen winning here. 2 0 at Signal Aduna Park. Absolutely brilliant for Schick. What a player. He is on. I know what he's on. He is on fire this season. That's all I'll say. Absolutely incredible game so far for Leverkusen. Alright then. Thorium Verts making a nice run in. Can we get the shot off? Oh no. Sometimes those kind of run-ins can actually be good, where you kind of just run, basically just run sideways and try and take your shot. Dortmund making another substitution. Hudson Adoy, up to Schick, can't get it. Oh, there we go. Musa Diaby, what a man. 3-0, absolutely incredible. I still can't believe we're actually winning 3-0. Like, un that's unbelievable, like... At Signal Aduna Park, like that is just incredible, absolute massive surprise to be honest, I was sure we were going to lose this, especially heading up to the world class difficulty level as well. Alright then, Dortmund coming down, there we go, we now win it back now, one minute of added time, final whistle should go, there we go, absolutely incredible victory. Like I was saying before, probably our underdog victory of the season here at Signal Aduna Park. I was not expecting that, I must say. Absolutely really surprised. I think we do have some tough fixtures coming up next year. We've, oh, yeah, we've Club Bruges in the Champions League. That's actually next. That will be for the uh, next episode, though. And I think it's Bayern Munich after that. But I must say, I must give a huge shout-out to Schick because he is absolutely banging them in. For us at the moment, Florian Verts as well is playing well, Diaby as well, it's just all going really, really well now the last three games despite the draw on the opening day of the season, but we still are unbeaten. 
If you guys did enjoy that video, make sure to like and subscribe. We will have lots of content coming up here on FIFA Career Mode Planet. Our next video will be a Bundesliga career mode guide, so basically a little bit like the La Liga one, talking about the best teams to use for a career mode in, but in the Bundesliga we'll be looking at some smaller teams, some bigger teams, some um, clubs with a very interesting history and philosophy, all that kind of type of stuff, like I was saying, very similar to the Liga. Um, that should be out hopefully tomorrow or Friday, and then hopefully over the weekend we'll be able to have episode 3 of the Leverkusen career mode out as well that's of course very very important as well so like I say thank you very much for watching um, I also want to give a lot of credit to a lot of the people who have been watching let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions or tips I'd love to know your feedback um, and that type of stuff I'm always uh, open to interacting with you guys in the comments section as well and I know I've said this a lot but like I say thank you very much for watching see you in the next video